The organization of space has been a concern of management scholars since the outset of the discipline. Beginning with Frederick Taylor, who measured, calculated, and arranged factory floor plans for optimal efficiency, space was first conceptualized as a stable physical environment that managers could manipulate and control to accomplish particular goals. To develop generalizable explanations, researchers took snapshots of certain spatial features, such as office buildings and layouts, so that they and their effects could be replicated across contexts. For a long time, researchers treated organizational space as a fixed and immobile container that facilitated work activities. However, significant shifts to where work is done requires management scholars to reconceptualize what organizational space is and account for how space moves, flows, and evolves as work is dispersed and mobile. In our manuscript, Process Studies of Organizational Space, which was recently published in the Academy of Management Annals, my colleagues and I synthesize over 150 articles that treat organizational space as a process. We define organizational space as the built environments that emerge from the process of organizing activities, objects, arrangements, and social practices. Based on the review, we identify five process orientations that the management scholars have used to examine space as dynamic and processual in nature. These are the developing, transitioning, imbricating, becoming, and constituting orientations. They highlight different theoretical foundations, assumptions, and domains of research. Overall, our review aims to help researchers identify how their work relates to the existing streams of process studies on organizational space. What is characteristic for process studies of organizational space is their focus on movements or activities that produce space and engage in organizing simultaneously. Instead of measuring physical structures, process researchers focus on boundary work activities that mark off boundaries or the material and temporal distinctions of space among individuals, groups, and organizations. In place of identifying different types of physical arrangements, scholars examine assembling activities that reconfigure human actors, practices, and material features into assemblages of space. As opposed to limiting analyses to a particular scale, process studies examine the reach of an organization's spatial configurations over time, namely how it expands or shrinks. With these process orientations and key constructs, our article urges researchers to continue studying how space is organized and how spatial activities organize. It calls for research to treat space and organizing as performative, ripe with possibilities. This approach could yield insights to many domains of management research, such as leadership, entrepreneurship, innovation, strategizing, international business, teamwork, governance, among many others. Our study calls for researchers to look beyond human agency and acknowledge that configurations of people, material artifacts, and technologies have the capacity to influence both organizational space and organizing. To find out more, please check out our article in the Academy of Management Annals.